Right, Joyce. Residents have a lot of concerns right now. Of course, those include keeping their homes, property, and people safe, but also the economic hit of this break in tourism and how to prevent fires from getting this close in the future. Stahican is often known for its natural beauty and lack of road access. You must travel in by air, foot, or boat, making it for many an escape. But for Chelsea Courtney, it's home. It's it's a gorgeous place to be. It's just very peaceful and then the, the community is probably my favorite part. Now she and others in the town of around 100 permanent residents are focused on protecting it. She and her neighbors have spent days clearing around their homes and protecting their property. So this is our hose system. Following news, the Pioneer fire had grown and was headed towards Tahican. Fire officials told tourists to leave so emergency crews can get in and out and issued level two evacuations. It comes after several highly attended public meetings. Many residents asking why the Pioneer Fire wasn't attacked more quickly or aggressively. Why wasn't the fire put out sooner? Officials say they did act, but conditions turned. It was the right response. It's just the fire got away from us. It's on a south facing slope. Um, you know, dry grasses. We had really dry, heavy fuels. More discussion will come on that later. For now, the focus is on putting out the fire that's burning and protecting homes and livelihoods. All along, it's been important for us to be heard. The new fire team that kind of transferred in the last few days has been really responsive and um, they're doing their best. Um, I think that it's easy to underestimate people that have lived here and you know that we may not know what's going on but we we do <laughs> and we are trying to be prepared and um we realize where we live but it's just it's something that's bigger than us and we do need help so and it's important to note that towns like Chelan and Manson are still open for business. Sometimes it's smoky there, sometimes it's clear, but they still want people to know that they can visit Joyce. This fire, it's getting closer to Stahican, mm -hmm. which is far apart, but sometimes people get confused right. and we know there's a lot of impacts to tourism there. And people might be wondering what they can do to help Stahican. Yes, yeah, Stahican specifically. Say that you had a trip planned out there. If you're planning to cancel, instead reschedule it or get a gift card instead of getting a refund. Or if you can afford it, even refuse the refund to help them out right now and know that if everything works out okay and people can visit again soon, they want those visitors as soon as possible, Joyce. Businesses rely on this time of year. Totally. Very important. Thank you.